activate easy mode for manifestations sounds good to me easy mode easy mode is very easy it's like oh my god it was like taking candy from a baby and it's not manipulation it's just your outlook on the situation is your meaning and that's what trip us up on what is before us a lot of times is because we have gave something meaning and the meaning we gave it ain't necessarily gotta be what we believe it is not know but believe the reason why i'm saying is is because yesterday i feel like a fucking celebrity i did reason being i had this uh business meeting yesterday i'm gonna just say it like that it was a meeting but the way the meeting went i did not know it was gonna be somebody else joining us okay so it was this guy from another country i'll just say it like that and it was a white girl and it was a man and the purpose of the meeting was for us to discuss a business idea i love the end to discuss how much we all could put in and invest in, in this idea we had ate at olive garden we had some margaritas this was wowing i loved it and the reason why i said i felt like a celebrity is because i did something that was really pertaining to me it was not nothing that I was invited to that, you know, was pertaining to something work-related or something pertaining to somebody else and me participating with them and tagging along. No. This was all orchestrated by a particular person. I ain't calling no name because it's confidential. I'm going to just say that. The, the whole... The situation, I can't speak on it until things get into motion. So that's what I'm going to say about that. So that's why it's confidential. And I can't speak on nobody's name or I can't, you know, speak on their race or nothing like that either because it's confidential. <laughs> right. This laundromat is so motherfucking packed. I did not know. I'm like, I walked in. Oh, I dodged the bullet. No, the fuck I didn't. Do. All of the laundries are taken. Right. I'm like, wow, this is why I like to do things early. This I like to get the, you know, the first dibs on things when it comes to the laundromat. I just can't wait till I get my own washing machine. Did I say laundry? I mean, um, washer. Damn, okay. Anywho, today is Sunday, uh, October the 13th. Oh my gosh, y'all, the 13th, the 13th. Um, I got so much going through my mind right now. Yeah, yesterday was super great. I didn't expect that to go like that, but it it happened so fucking wowing. Everything worked out in my favor. It did. Me and the uh, girl, we exchanged numbers, and... Yeah, we're going to keep in contact and yeah, let's see what we can make of this idea. Yeah, I bet y'all are wondering what the fuck is the idea. You will see. You will see. You will see. Yeah, it's something that is going to be... Hmm. It's going to have the touch of Mystic Lady Z amongst the other two. Mm-hmm. But Yeah. Manifest on ease mode. We make things hard in our life due to the fact that it's our perception, how we've been programmed. I always say that our programs are the things that are determining what we see, how we feel, and how we think, and how we depict others as, you know, how we, you know, size people up or you know say well y'all get the point <laughs> right anywho 
I had an awesome time yesterday at that meeting. It was so good. This was, I just felt super special. I felt like about time. I'm in control, not of the project, because that, that's what we're calling it, our project, until we can really get things unfolded how it's supposed to be. But yeah, easy mode. Activate easy mode for manifestations. It all falls back on your perception of yourself first. How do you look at yourself? How do you talk to yourself? How compassionate and forgiving you are of yourself when you feel like you made a mistake. When you feel like that, you know, okay. Hey, they are begging back. Shit. All right. This is good. 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 What you focus on grows. Attention is currency. The current C, like what you're currently seeing, is only your perception of yourself. Any environment you put yourself in, you did that yourself. Any person that you're around for that day, you did that yourself. You say, well, when I go in a grocery store, I don't put myself around people. People are beat up. Well, due to the environment, is it a nasty environment? Is it a, you know a sophisticated a classy environment see you based upon what you think of yourself those are the environments you you're gonna be in oh my god that's what happened when you don't watch your young ones shit like that happens anyway i'm about to wrap this video up because it said i had 17 minutes left but i move certain ways due to the fact that you know I have things within my life that just does not involve me and I have to put that in you know proper perspective when I do make decisions for bigger and better things because everybody ain't ready for bigger and better things you know with people mindsets being stuck on a certain way of living, it causes, how can I say, setbacks. And it make things seem, seems like that I'm stagnated, but I know the truth. So, yeah, I'm going to just say that. This is just me just touching bases with myself about what happened yesterday. And I was feeling super, super excited and super special. And I didn't know what to expect. I didn't anticipate nothing. But when I got there, it was just, wow. It was, wow. It was and very surreal experience for me. And I'm just sharing this. That's what happens. You got to know what the fuck you want in this life. With your life. You, you got to know because you just can't just wait for things to just drop in your lap. You have to, you know, prioritize things to move yourself forward and the direction you want to go. Because shit ain't going to just fall out the sky and happen for you. That's not how it works. Damn, I've already been on here about 10 minutes. I said five minutes, but... Oh, well, I'm going to get ready to go back in now. I don't even know if it's in the dryers because it's so... Well, ain't that many people in there, but they got the washers. Anyhow, I just wanted to talk about that. I might release that today on the 13th because this is super excited. I'm super excited about this project. I know y'all like, girl, you leave out so much details. I know, I told you it's confidential. But I wanted to speak on it because I was super excited. And, you know, I share certain things on my YouTube channel. So, that's all. It's just me sharing that's it. But when the... Y'all see my tattoo? Yeah, I've been headed. I even got a ring. 
I'm gonna show y'all. I don't even think I showed y'all my ring, but this one, hold up. Let's see, can I get it? That's the sun, that's the tattoo I got on my arm right there on that one right there. Yeah. Or my hand. <laughs> I said my arm. My hand. That's the same tattoo. But anyway, that's why I was talking about that. Like I'm demonic. That particular person I'm around because they don't understand symbolisms. Nothing affects a person unless you mentally start to believe in that shit, you know. What you accept is your own cause of triggering and you know traumatizing it's like a lot of people say you just don't know what i've been through as a child you just don't know how this person treated me you just don't know and i know it's been several videos but that's why i tell you each day i expect to learn something new about myself and i've learned nothing happens to you other than through memory the more you think about something whether good or bad you the one conjuring up those thoughts. You the one causing, triggering yourself to feel those emotions. You are. Nothing outside of yourself is doing it. It's nothing but your mind. That's why they say imagination rules the nation. And you're like, that's kitty. Oh, okay. It's kitty. You can believe whatever you want to believe. That's the thing. People think everything. No, that's not how you do that. I wasn't brought up that way. No, that's not right. You shouldn't be doing it. Why? Because you scared? Because you want to follow the traditional ways or you want to follow, you know, society ways of living? Societal? Society is nothing but a group of people who follow certain programs. That's it. That's what society is. Diversity. What is that? When you have your own mind and you decide that you're going to go left when everybody is going right, whatever the fuck that is. But anywho, I think I've said enough. I got to go in there and check on my clothes. It's looking mighty empty. Now, that's what I like. I like emptiness. I don't like being around a lot of people because it's like I, I'm very sensitive to energy. That's why I say that. Not that, you know, for other fucked up reasons, but I'm just sensitive to energy. That's why I say that. Yeah, I just love loving on Zakita. I love learning new things about Zakita. And I love just tearing down the process of me thinking that I know things when the first rule of wisdom is to know that you know nothing. That's the first rule of having wisdom. Things are constantly changing. And when you know that, you don't take things so seriously. You focus on what you would like to focus on. You give your fucks and your cares about the things you want to give your fucks and your cares about. And you just remain in peace. Calm waters. No turbulence. I like a little turbulence at times because it shakes shit up. And it allows me to learn as well. Just a little. I don't like a whole lot of chaos and confusion. Just I, I, I will permit a little at times. Because I'm like, oh, this is boring. You know, just turn up the notch a little bit. We're going to turn it up. That's when I say with hard mode. I ain't say expert mode. Because I'm still working on that. But easy mode is not expert mode. Easy mode is like you coasting. You you say I got little, you know, bumps and, you, you know, uh, how can I say this? Little derails popping up here and there once in a while. But it's nothing that you're not able to, you know, achieve. Nothing that you're not able to handle. That's what I meant to say. Conquer. Conquer. The first person you conquer is yourself, your mind. I made a video, but it did not get that much attention. And it was about the bicam bicameral mind. And that is like the origins of programs, of consciousness, of how we perceive reality as a whole. That's what they wanted for us to do. Perceive reality as a whole as one 
as a unity thing and we have did that that's why when people have different mindsets or they have different beliefs people be like, be like you going to hell you need to get that them that that devil out of your ass uh, some stupid i don't whatever a person believe it's your prerogative if it's getting you results that you want in your life your prerogative I, See, this is why I think the way I think about a lot of things. People be like, that's a fucked up individual. Mm, 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 mm. Well, that's your perception. I used to say that about people. And I'm like, if they like to live in ignorance and people don't like educating themselves, who am I to judge them? That's on them. But with me, I just love, love, love discovering or realizing things about myself. I do. And that is, what can I say that is? That's a superpower. That is something that allows that individual to always be authentic. To always be in their space all the time. I'm talking about mentally. I'm going to address that now too. A lot of times, you, you can't change. Well,